anything about it, you just can stand outside and, and watch. Yeah, it's hard for me. Yeah. Like, I was like in panic. You know, I tried to control myself, but this fight, I know is like, it's the fight for Nina, you know? She has to win, you know, have a lot of pressure. And even I, I put pressure on her, yeah. you know, because I know she's, she can be the, the champion, she will be. And I want she do well, I know she can. I train with her every, every day, you know? I know expect another thing, I expect only she'll win. And this is the thing. Uh, I mean, more like, more like scared of it a little bit if she don't show who she is. You know, this is a, a very sad thing for an athlete when you step in that cage and don't show who they are. And I'm very happy to tonight Nina show the world what is she capable of. What has the last two weeks been like for you? Um, you know, celebrating but also trying to get her ready for the fight? You know, it was hard for me too. Like after that fight, uh, how was my, my camp, how was all the, the, the promo for that fight killing me? Like, yeah. I have to make my, 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 my brain, my body, and my spirit like ready for that moment. And it was very hard because I, I, I say, I talk to my friends, like I watched that fight like outside. My, my soul was outside to watch that fight. And when, when I back in, like it was hard for sleep. I know sleep for five days. Literally, I saw every day the sun come out. And uh, I know I have to like kind of focus because Nina have fight, have the fight right. Right in the next week, I have to be like, you know, like more like patience and then, but it was hard for me at the same time. All the, the, the adrenaline is still in me because it was so fast. And I know it's gonna be like that, but my body ready for five rounds. And when everything like was so fast, my body can handle. And it was like, at the end of the weekend, everything starts to become together, you know, and I went right away to help Nina, and everything is like was fine. Um, you talked about what it's like watching her. Are you are you giving like good advice when you're coaching her? Or are you just like freaking out, like screaming and, and kind of panicking? A bit? No, I don't. I give you good advice for yeah. sure because um, we train together every day. You know, I know everything she can do, and in striking in jiu-jitsu, also I'm a well-rounded fighter. I know everything. I'm black belt in Brazilian jiu-jitsu, and I train in judo at the same time. And striking, like, uh, also, I, I know everything about. Her. I keep learning, but uh, yeah. I know I'm around to like help her. And uh, for sure, I keep like everything the way we training. You know, it's all the movement. It's not tough, tough, tough though for you to say like, I know what I'm supposed to say, but I'm just, I'm just like want to scream and like. Just yeah, like oh, just you know, like to to kind of panic instead of staying as a coach. You know what I mean? No, I, I keep it like simple. Sometimes I I keep it say more like things, yeah, yeah. and then she she can do only one sometimes, you know. But I keep control, and everything was fine tonight. You know. Uh, when did I guess uh, when did it set set into you what you had done, uh, you know, against Ronda? Like when did when did it kind of become real life? That, that happened and not like, you know, kind of a, you said you were kind of out of your body watching it kind of thing. You wanted to finally say, like, oh yeah, that happened. That was, you know, that was. Yeah, right, right after the, the fit day, yeah. you know, I, I sleep again, you know, I like, I'd be able to rest. And then I saw everything was real. I keep, I watch, watch over and over. Like, and now I accept, you know, and I will keep doing. Amanda, you just recently said that You'd like to fight the winner of the Holly Holm for main fight and unify the two belts. Yeah, Conor McGregor did it, you know, why I can't. And I feel like I want a more challenge for my career, you know. I know I know I can be a champion in 145 too. And that's why I, I, put, I push, push my Twitter and everywhere. And uh, I, I, I hope Don White can give it to me the opportunity. I will show him the real champion he had. How would you see yourself defending? Uh, <clears throat> and, uh, both belts, I don't know, you know, I think if it, they give it to me the opportunity, I'm going to focus the fight first and then after we can talk about it. But I will want to fight the winner, Holly, against Germany. I beat Germany already, you had me. And if you Holly won, whatever, I will, I will want to fight. What do you see in Holly's game? That you think I think Holly have enough trips. Jiu-Jitsu to take this, this fight on the ground and then maybe like one 
you know, like ground the pounds or things like that. But uh, I don't think she have a chance in stand up. But you MMA is like crazy. Everything can happen. But this fight can go uh, in either way. So you you, you do believe your stand up is much superior? The both, yes. And also I have experience on the ground. I can take this fight whatever I want. You know, I know how to I work with a long long reach and take this fight down like I did with Germany and finish the fight. And if you do uh, get the belt, would you want to stay at 145 or do you see yourself at 135? You know, I, you know, I want to take the belt first and then decide with my coach. I really want the 145 belt, my next step. Have you talked to Danny yet? Not yet, but I know he's very busy and tomorrow I will text him. Has your pick up with you for a, a defense in the belt that you already have? Will you take it, or are you going to be pushing for the 145, no matter what? You know, I, I defend already with the most dominated athlete on the planet, you know. 48 seconds. I think I deserve it. Like, if I ask you for my next fight, I think I deserve it. And I think the fans want to see, too. Like, a, uh, a female fight go to another, another weight class and then take the two belts. Everybody got so excited with when Conor did it. I think with the... With me, they want to be so excited too. And if the UFC does what, like what they did Connor, and they made him, in a sense, seem like he had to choose one of the belts, which belt would you keep? Uh, I think 135 because having more girls, you know, the division. But I will go to 145 in my next step. Perfect. Thank you. How would you compare, you. Would you compare the, uh, uh, the challenge from, uh, uh, you know, winning Ronda Rousey and then uh, challenging whoever wins in 145? How will you compare the challenge? Do you think it will be a, a faster win or? A... I, w I train, you know, for whatever happened, the fight. I, you know, capitalize it. But I will look for the, the fast because I like the bonus at the end of the day, you know. And uh, whatever, I always look for uh, finish the fights faster than I can.